for the next 90 days, I'm gonna be training exactly like a superhero. And this is what I look like right now. And I weigh over 240 pounds. So to get me in superhero shape, I hired a Hollywood trainer who's helped Captain America get jacked. This is where the superhero is made. And when I say superhero, I mean it. I'm gonna be putting my body to the test with the most insane workouts possible. The first step to look like a superhero is to eat right, so we need to head to the grocery store. Yes, and no cookies. This is a new flavor. Fudge covered Oreos. How do you know that's a new flavor? Are you really down this aisle that much? <laughs> no, no, no. There's superheroes on the boxes. <laughs> no. We are starting from the bottom. Here we go. What flavor is this? This is the flavor you should be drinking. Now we're on the right start. Watermelon. In the car. I'm learning. Now things are starting to get real. I removed all of the junk food from my house and replaced it with this green stuff. I don't even know what this is. <sighs> I'm about to go to sleep on night one. This is when I would normally want a midnight snack, but I have to stay strong, so I'll see you guys in the morning. Now I am heading to the gym for one of the very first times. This is definitely a lifestyle change. Ready to rock and roll? Go up, hold. You hold, you go up, you go down, you open. I have to move on to some leg stuff. I hate legs. The reason why I made legs second today is because you wouldn't be able to get up out of that chair if we did it first. <sighs> this is one of the hardest things I've ever done in my life. I underestimated how tough this is going to be. I'm working out so hard because at the end of this video, I'll be putting my body to the test on a Hollywood set filming a superhero fight scene. I have a really bad habit of eating super unhealthy things right when I wake up, but if I want to look like a superhero, all of that has to go, so let's go see how much I weigh. I weigh the exact same today and it's going to be a massive challenge because of the video we're filming. We're building the world's largest cookie and you know I love cookies so this is gonna suck. That's why we got a bunch for you. Why are you putting the cookies in my pocket? <laughs> filming this giant cookie video is a massive temptation and it's making this challenge much harder. Hey, I want everybody to keep an eye on Matthew, make sure that he doesn't eat any of this. And because I'm eating much less and working out, I'm very tired. I'm just extremely tired. I worked out really hard yesterday. I'm not eating as much as I'm used to. Over the next few days, I continued my training. I currently weigh one pound less, which is a great start, but definitely not enough to become a superhero. Matthew's up front eating his healthy food, but what he doesn't know is we got him lunch in the show. Are you boys ready? <laughs> what is going on right now? I'm just trying to diet. Louder! <laughs> That is the saddest plate in the world. That lunch was super painful, just like the next few days of my training. <clears throat> I am so out of shape. Working out every day like this, doing hours of cardio and weight training is one of the hardest challenges I've ever given myself. It is day number nine and I have lost seven pounds so far. Eight o'clock at night, we're at the movies and they're eating a bunch of junk food. I wish you would have told me we're seeing Ant-Man. I'm not gonna lie, that popcorn looks delicious. Do you want film? Yeah, I do. Okay. <gasps> Day 17 was super busy. First, I started with breakfast. I feel like egg whites for breakfast every single day. No salt, no pepper, not even the yolk. This is extremely difficult for me because this was my old breakfast, cookies and milk. Then I flew to Texas to work out with the Liver King, who's known for working out in crazy ways and only eats raw meat. I am the Liver King! I'm back here. Do I get sunglasses? Did our ancestors get sunglasses? So I should take these off. Let me hold them for you. That's what you do with sunglasses. Oh my God. Load them up! How much weight am I about to pull? 120 on this lead, 70 pound kettlebells in each hand, 70 pounds in the backpack, 20 pound ankle weight. Oh. Hey. When you think you wanna put it down, don't. Pulling 400 pounds, it's the hardest thing I've ever done. Uh. This is what Barbarian is about. Momentum, uh. more! I don't think I can do this. What kind of man can you call yourself? You can't carry your own weight. Has anyone ever quit? He's buried at the end of the property. Can I get some water? Is that good? Matt, move! More! Ah, ah, Let it out! Ah, Uncaged! Ah, there you go. There you go. Back home, the team was up to no good. We're gonna have a company barbecue in Matt's office. So we're gonna need some hot dog buns and some hamburger buns. Now's the time to go! Tap! Tap! 
There you go. All right, let's give it a go. There you go. You got a pull. I can't do that. Your legs were off the ground. You legitimately had a pull. Now let's get two. Guess what? You just got two pulls. Yeah. You've been whining all day about how hot you are. So I got you a present, an Arctic plunge. This is key to every superhero's recovery. You're gonna love it. Oh, no, I'm not. There we go. <laughs> He holds the record for the world's shortest cold plunge. When Matt gets back from Texas, he's gonna be super hungry, but we got him covered. Let's get down to some liver, bro, because liver is king. It's delicious, it's primal. It's gonna nourish you in ways that nothing else can. Oh, it's so chewy. Oh, it's so bad. You had the good piece, man. That was the good piece? I'd hate to try the bad piece. <laughs> Cheers. When I came home from superhero training with Liver King, I found out what the boys were up to. Oh my gosh, what happened in here? There's a microwave on my computer. <laughs> Why is there hot dogs in my office? Welcome back. I'm gonna call my trainer and show him this. Look at you, Mr. Lee. <laughs> my friends just put all of this in my office. Can I have any of this? Don't touch any of that. <laughs> just waking up, it's day 20. I have a lot of big workouts planned, but let's first go see how much I weigh. Wow, I weigh 225 pounds, which means I have lost 15 pounds so far. Things are progressing very quickly. Let's go work out. Superheroes don't give up, don't stop. What? what? This challenge is the hardest thing I've ever done, but I'm super proud of myself. So at this point in the transformation, we really gotta take it up another notch. I've added a resistance band to the exercise, so there's no rest. Superheroes don't rest, Matthew does not rest. <laughs> You can see now, even when we're working here, you see the shoulders are coming in. You couldn't see it before, but now it's defining. The wait till we get to the end of this, when this superhero just pops onto the screen. On day 25, my favorite NBA team, the world champion Denver Nuggets, invited me for a personal tour of the arena. Am I allowed to step on the court? Yeah. I can just go. go oh my God. Where I was also able to work out and play on a real NBA basketball court. This is so crazy. I am on the Denver Nuggets court right now. Growing up, I would come to Nuggets games and I would sit way over there, and now I am standing on the court. Half court. After getting the private tour, I got to watch the playoff game in the VIP suite. There is an entire mini bar of delicious food right there, and I can't have any of it. But at least I can watch the game. This was such an incredible experience and the food was looking too delicious, so I caved in. I can't resist, this is my first cheat meal. The Denver Nuggets won the game, but I cheated on my diet really badly, which means I'm going to have to diet and work out extremely hard tomorrow. Because I cheated on my diet for the first time, my friends booked a special workout as a punishment. Go yoga. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, this is crazy. The reason they call this goat yoga is because I'm here. This feels like a really intense massage right now. <laughs> oh my god! This is my favorite pose so far. Because we're literally just laying down. Over the next week, I continued my training to prepare for my superhero action scene. Now that I'm getting closer to the superhero body, I need to learn how to move like a superhero. And that's where my friend Zealous comes in. He's famous for recreating superhero stunts in real life. <sighs> wow. So the stunt that Matt's gonna be learning is one that Miles Morales does in Into the Spider-Verse, the first movie. He's running towards a taxi and he has to speedball over it so he doesn't get absolutely T-boned. It looks like this. Just like our videos, if you don't do this, I'm slapping. And we slap hard. Come on! Yeah! Let's go! That's what I'm talking about. And I hurt my wrist a little bit. So we're now stepping it up to level two. This is a stunt that Thor did in Thor Ragnarok. Instead of diving over bad guys like Thor does, Matt's gonna be diving over me. Let me give you an example. During this entire journey, I've had to drink a ton of water, which can be very boring. That's why this entire time I've been using Air Up, the sponsor of this video. If he hits me, then I'm gonna slap him. Ready? Boom! Boom! Yeah! Boom! is a new take on hydration. Unlike other flavored drinks that are loaded with artificial flavors and sweeteners, all of Arab's flavor comes through smell. Can I try? It actually tastes like orange creamsicle. No flavors or sweeteners necessary. Level one and two are easy compared to what level three is because every single superhero needs to do this, which is a front flip. And we're gonna do it on this mat. This is the hardest part of the challenge so far. Oh, <laughs> Let me try again. That's like my biggest fear. I do not like spinning in the air like that. You did really well in level one, really well in level two, but you failed level three and I don't want to do this. I'm gonna Thanos slap you. 
out of existence. Are you ready for this, Matt? No. If you want to try the newest technology in hydration, use code BEAM for 20% off all orders. Let's go! You guys have to subscribe for that. How bad is it? Oh! Dude, it's yellow here. No way, dude. It's day number 40. We're starting out by going on a run. Then we'll be going to Universal Studios and ending the day with meeting the best boxer of all time, Mike Tyson. We're heading up to the Hollywood sign. This is quite a run. This is way too early for me. Let's do this. Right? Let's yeah. Go. My pants are falling down. They don't fit like they used to. <laughs> it's a good thing. Go, go, go. Start for those legs. This is 6 a.m. grind, my friend. This is where the superhero was made. My calves are burning. I hear you, but that doesn't mean you're gonna stop. Let's do it. Ah, come on. I'm dying. You're so fast. Keep pushing through. Way to go. Now what? We go back down. You can't tell me that when we came up. How'd you think we were going to get back to the car? <laughs> After running down the mountain, it was time to head to Universal Studios where superhero movies are made. We made it, baby! I feel like I should get a workout in. <laughs> you see that form? I'm getting better. So they have a giant escalator and a giant staircase. I'm going to take the stairs. Meet you at the top. Come on, pick up the pace. You're losing. Later, buddy. <laughs> I'm working out everywhere I go. Pick up the pace. Let's go! We made it to Hogwarts, baby. We're in Harry Potter world right now, and Aaron is being his own wizard, making all of the food disappear. Hey, I've got Matthew Beam's credit card. Do you want to go get some snacks? Okay. Yeah. You can go. <laughs> can we actually get this? Can I get the cookies and cream fudge, please? You get candy. You get candy. You get candy. You don't get candy. And then it was time for me to learn how to get into superhero shape from the greatest boxer of all time, Mike Tyson. That's my dream to get punched by you. Every YouTuber I've seen, they want me to hit them. Hey, guy. Yeah. After getting punched by Mike Tyson, day 47 had an amazing surprise. I am kind of lost for words right now. I am trying my best not to cry and get emotional. We are closing in on 4 million subscribers today. This is such a special moment. I am so thankful for everyone watching these videos. Yeah! 4 million! To celebrate 4 million subscribers, my friends threw me an amazing party. This is the best day ever. We've been messing with Matt about his diet a lot, and we thought we'd do something nice for him. Everything here he can eat. You guys went all out with the peanut. I have to give it to you. McDonald's french fries made from apples. This is twice the weight I was doing last week. Now we're putting in that work. There we go. All right, nice form. When I started this, I was doing 30 pounds less than I am right now, pushing my body to new limits, new heights. During this challenge, I've had the opportunity to select the foods that I'll be putting into my body in order to get into superhero shape. On day 65, I realized not everyone has the same opportunity. So we went shopping and purchased over 700 pounds of food for us to deliver and donate to my local food bank. Some rice, some more beans, more beans. This is the biggest scale I've used to weigh myself on this journey. I'm kind of nervous. What do I weigh, Noah? Uh, 209 pounds. That's actually really good. During this video, I've been trained to be like a superhero, but after spending the day here, I realized the volunteers are the real life superheroes. I do it every day. I go out and I do mobile pantries, drop off the food. You're in high school and you yeah. volunteer? Yeah. We had to get it for like school hours, but then I started doing this and I realized that it was really like rewarding. And this is big. I know I am. <laughs> it's a lot. We couldn't do it without you all. So we also want to donate $4,000 as well. Fantastic. Thank you so much. We're getting very close to the end of my transformation. Soon I'll be filming with the Marvel team, so I need to prepare. And that's where my friend Jesse James West comes in. He's a fitness superstar, and today he'll be training me to get into Marvel superhero shape. See his meat sticks? I'm gonna slap. Slap. <laughs> When is the last time you trained leg? Uh, like a week ago. He should be recovered and ready. We'll start off nice and light. Bulgarian split squat. Am I gonna be doing the same weight as you? I think you should. <laughs> there we go, one, get five, two. Come on now, you wanna be weak? Or you wanna be strong? Yeah, that's the face of glory. That was just a warm up. That was fun. He's still curling when he puts the weights back. We got squats. This builds character. I hate this. Quit talking under the bar. Up, up, two more. Okay. Shut up and do it. Oh, good! That's it, that's all you need. We're done, right? I'll let you finish this workout under one condition. What's that? Get in the cold plunge. He holds the record for the world's shortest cold plunge. You're good, you're good, you're good. He's good! It's so cold! I got it! Get lower, no, get lower, do it! Thank you! It's so cold! Hey, look, look, at me, look at me in the eyes! Look at me in the eyes now! It's so cold, buddy! Breathe, breathe, breathe. 
I can't. Yes, you can. No! No! I can't watch. Buddy, I'm just chilling. I can't feel my legs. Before shooting my Marvel action scene, I have one last workout with my trainer. These arms did not look like this. They were like half the size. The way we've been able to accomplish this when he's traveling the globe is through ATU Mobile. I'm able to be his trainer even when he's not here. And that's the beauty of it. 36 seconds, more than double what we did the first time we ever walked in. After getting a great workout in on day 90, it's finally time to become a superhero. Hey, what's going on? My name is Gita Silver Green. I've been a Ninja Turtle, an Avenger, a Transformer. And today we're at Jam, where some of the best martial artists, movers, performers, all train for the entertainment industry. Today we're gonna teach Matthew how to fake fight like this. <laughs> this is crazy. Today we're doing exactly what Marvel actors would do to prepare for an action scene in the movies. So I put together a combination of moves that take from Captain America, Thor, Hulk, Black Panther, and put them all into one superhero to make an eight beat piece of choreography for you to perform in one take. This is exactly what you guys would do for a movie. Yes. And my trainer, Guy, has been in some of the most iconic Marvel scenes of all time, and today it's my turn. We started the Marvel stunt training with a warm up to awake my inner superhero. This hand is so important because if this hand's dead, even though that hand's working, it looks bad. So we pick it up to protect ourselves. So you just have to duck low enough that I clear your head, throw, showing the hook. I know that he's ducked now. I throw it over. We practiced the techniques of the fight scene for hours to make sure I was ready for the big screen. Is this how close that you guys would do that, like in an actual movie scene? Yep. It's that far. Yep. And it looks that real. Exactly. You don't want to hit hard and not move. You want to move your whole body and then just moves off. You're about to be an Avenger, brother. These guys are my villains. Don't be afraid to open up your voice when you're throwing punches. Ah, louder. Louder. Ah, I'm starting to do a lot better. Position. After 90 days of hard work, it's finally time for me to put my new body to the test and shoot this superhero fight scene. I'm impressing myself right now. Time to become a superhero on this take. Ready, camera's rolling. Three, two, one, action. This is what superhero movie fight scenes look like behind the scenes. And now let's watch it through the Marvel Fight Director's camera. Three, two, one, action! Over the last 90 days, I went from 240 pounds down to 199 pounds. I went from 30% body fat down to 9% body fat. This was truly an amazing experience. I appreciate everyone's help. I enjoyed every second.